I mean, yeah, sure, why not? Well, that one. I mean... Clearly not that one. I hate this game. <laughs> I hate it when it does this sort of stuff. Also, yeah, I mean, what's bad. happened here? You're done. No, no death for you, but death. I'm done. There's nothing I can do. It's stuck. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Maybe he's still falling. Uh, okay, I guess I'll restart. Have you previously played King's Quest V? Yep. So which one was it? That low one here. Yeah, that low one was the one that couldn't hold you, hold your weight. Is it random? How are you supposed to know? Are there some audio cues? And why isn't it triggering anything? Like, it's... I'm stuck again because of this. Hmm. Oh, it's got a warning off in the Scum VM thing. Oh, it's been doing that the whole time. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, right. Like, I'm... Yeah, alright. Great, we're gonna have to keep doing this. Was it after every fight in Indiana Jones? I think we tried something like that, but I don't think it worked out well for us. No, that sounds fair. Um, there was something. Right, so... Before, that one didn't drop me. I think just jump across all the top ones. Okay. Uh, Let's see if, see if that works. Because the first one has to, right? Okay, so you're going to have to do that last one. I think it's to the right. Oh yes, the bridge, and, this, and again, it's not gonna. All right, this is this is that part of the game. Think I can just walk? Give it a go. Oh god. Game's evil. Cedric! Great hunger grows a tooth. Without food he may soon die. Oh. Well, Graham, remember when you turned down that last meal at home? Well, he really, um, succumbed quickly. <laughs> I've never seen someone, um, turn that fast. Should we, should we need to eat something? That was the best custard pie Graham has ever eaten. I'm sus. Cedric! <laughs> oh well. Oh, action scene. <laughs> Oh, this is funky. <laughs> Drat, my sled is broken. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Graham. That was great.
What's wrong, Mr. Uh, Eagle? I'm so weak from hunger. I haven't been able to catch any food for days. I can barely fly anymore. I'd like to help you. Let me see what I can do. <coughs> Thank you. I need food. I don't think I have anything. I see. think we're missing an item. That won't help food, the poor eagle. <laughs> we need food. So we're still missing stuff. Yeah, I think so. Ah, uh, okay. We weren't ready. Where else did we go? Like, all right. Um. What other options were there left in this place? Can we, can we go back? I'm just thinking. We had a kitchen, didn't we? In that, in the, in the bandit place. Yeah, I tried to click on stuff, but I mean, it's easily possible that I missed something. Well, I think maybe we should go right because that we weren't in. Were we in a kitchen or a pantry? I thought we were in a pantry. Well, I guess technically there'd be food in both. Uh, I guess we, yeah, we could at least try. It couldn't hurt. Yeah, because there's no obvious, like, actual food here. Inside the cupboard, Graham sees a large, juicy leg of lamb. Oh, never mind. There's, there's very much food. Reaching into the open cupboard, Graham pulls out the savory leg of lamb. There is nothing else of interest inside the kitchen cupboard. Right, well, I guess actually that kind of covers it, if that's... We gotta plan our next job, you guys. <laughs> We're so slow! This time, rub them out for good. That wasn't a very smart move. No. Well, I might have guessed. Right. The custard pie seems a weird thing to eat, like... I've assumed yeah, we did Yeah, see, to... I thought it was weird, but... But I guess that's what it's for. Sustenance. Do all this again. Well, I think we'll probably eat. Right, so we guess we'll eat the leg of lamb. What, we don't want to give the bird the custard pie? We want to give the bird the custard pie. Well, I don't think it matters either way, but like... I think he's going to want the meat. Yeah, Surely. Maybe. I just, I, it feels weird to eat the, eat the pie first. A few hours later... <laughs> well, yeah, in that we're missing the context of what we're going to... See, yeah, Graham I mean, it's, it's the dessert, if anything. Yeah, but I think the bird would want the meat. No, stay away from the end. Are you kidding? Ah! <laughs> oh, oh, that last step. Ah, uh, I didn't save, did I? Bandits again, I think, was the last day to save. game. I swear I just clicked before. I didn't navigate. <laughs> and it was fine. Maybe I'm You've wrong. always got to walk yourself off a cliff. Yeah, multiple times. That's the, that's the way of these games. Right, we will save again here.
few hours later. Graham began. Uh, gonna predict it all. Graham died. Yeah, I swear I just clicked over there before. Well, I didn't do that. Oh, I don't think I did. Graham noticed. Guess all the same save points. grows acute. Without food, he may soon what? die. Oh yeah, we ate before we left the screen last time. But he didn't warn me about being hungry. Well, Graham, remember when you... Oh, I... Mm. I thought it was like a thing where it... It's time -based. You get a I warning. I think he did try to give you a warning, but no, you clicked through it. Oh, oh, this time. Was a... I think it's it it doesn't trigger if you fall Ooh, off from the rocks. Like it's not falling itself. It seems to be falling specifically from these rocks because you managed to get to the other side. I think it's just my positioning. Like it has. If I I went too early on that side. So if you do if you do food or save and then do food now. Um, alright. Since we don't want to make that jump again. Mm. No, that would be nice not to do that again. Cedric! Oh, uh, that never gets old. Weirdly. Yeah, that's perhaps one of the best, best parts of the game. This, however, I could stand not to watch again. But it's quite funny when he stacks it. Drat, my sled. I was lucky. Um, Graham was prescient and knew he needed a sled. Yeah. What's wrong, Mister? I'm so. I'd like. <coughs> Here, take this. Perhaps it will help you. You are a kind man to share your meager food with a poor bird, especially up here in these snowy mountains. Well, I couldn't just stand there and let you starve to death. What kind of person would I be? You have shown yourself to be a kind, compassionate man. And I will not forget what you did for me. Goodbye, dear friend. <laughs> That's it. I will never forget this, but I will also never repay it. Oh no. Oh. I am Queen Isabella, and you have entered my domain now. I command you to kneel before me, since both you and your friend over there have so thoughtlessly invaded my territory without my permission or knowledge, I have decided you shall both be put to death. Take him away, my pet. Play, play your harp. I think that Warning. makes sense. This cartoon contains material that may be necessary for information or clues to complete this game. Please be sure to check your inventory if you decide to skip. So, did you... do you know you needed to do that? That just made sense to me. 
Why? Hello? I don't know. <laughs> There's something about that. Is there not? I mean, we haven't used it. <laughs> um, okay. Um, I mean, I guess There's something it makes... else. It was that or the... Oh, we can't use the pie. Wait, my pet. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I'm not sure why. Alright. Well, it worked, so... I won't argue. I thought it was a cutscene. <laughs> I thought we were dead. <laughs> that was very lovely music. I've never heard anything quite that beautiful before. I think I felt my heart melting. Just a little bit. Just enough, that is. To allow you a chance for your freedom. A vicious yeti has entered the area and taken up residence in my prized crystal cave. So far, I have been unable to extricate him from either the cave or my territory. If you can rid me of the yeti, I will release both you and your owl friend, and you two can continue on your journey unhindered. You may rise now. I wish you luck in defeating the yeti. If you succeed, you will have my undying gratitude. Go with him, Sir Grey Wolf. Show him the way to the Crystal Cave. You may go now. Sir Grey Wolf will lead the way. <laughs> Sir Grey Wolf. I feel like there was something about what the princess said. I felt like some. Did not say heart. I felt like someone said it was heartwarming. I just thought it was very sad. No, no, she was sad, and it was the only thing that made her happy. Oh, okay. Was the harp? I swear there was. She said Down something about the heartwarming, cave. or there you will find a yeti. Warmed your soul, or something like that. Right. I feel like she said something like that. <laughs> uh, either way, that was literally the first thought that came into my mind when I saw an ice cream. <laughs> Oh wow. What an Ow. abominable situation Graham has found himself oh, in. I didn't save, of course. <laughs> uh, wandered in. You're gonna have to be quite quick with whatever that is that you need to do. Oh my god, okay, I didn't save all the way back there. You need to eat. Oh. Mmm. I would be curious if the eagle Cedric. does eat the custard pie. Well, I could always try, I suppose, but then we have to eat the meat. No, I'm just no, now. I'm just curious about whether we'd eat the custard pie at all. Mm -hmm. But I presume we need to give him something. <laughs> Unless it's like one of those situations where you specifically don't need to. It's just a nice thing to do. Do you think it's a screw you over situation? Well, I, what, I don't know how it would screw you Rat. over, though. My sled is broken. Unless you need, like, the lamb or the pie for something. Uh... Like, later. Like, is this just a... a way to lose an item? Are you that much of a bastard game? Well, it would be very counter to everything else we've been doing in the game. The whole game has been about helping animals. Here, take... And you get points for it, so it must be doable then, right? Because you have to complete the game. You are a kind man. Well, I... You have... I'm assuming he'll come back and help us at some point. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe. I'm just trying to think. There's not much we could use. His arms are out weird in that picture. Yeah, that is weird. I am Queen Isabella, and you have entered my domain now. I command you to kneel before me. Since both you and your friend over there have so thoughtlessly invaded my territory without my permission or knowledge, I have decided you shall both be put to death. Take him away, my pet. Pretty harsh. Warning, this cartoon contains material.
Yonder's the Christmas cave. <laughs> 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 that save. Yeah. Right, so what do we think is gonna be on this Yeti? What do you think how how do you think we I think we've got to Deal give him something, so hammer him to death? I guess all we've got is this wax that we haven't used, right? That's, yeah, that's pretty much still it. Still got a tambourine. I'm going to load up on wax. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> 